Listen up. It's time for you to get over your fear of video. It's time for you to get over your fear of recording video in public, okay? Hey, how's it going? My name is Monique and welcome to the Video is a Lifestyle YouTube channel. And I wanna share with you the number one tip, the number one way, the number one, oh my goodness, this is so amazing, way on how to get over your fear of recording in public. Check it out. All right, so I have a major confession. So I remember when it was six years ago and I used to be deathly afraid to create video, but more specifically in a public place just like this, right? You would get so concerned. You would be concerned about number one, whether you're too loud. Number two, the fact that, okay, the proximity to the next person to you. Or number three, whether you would look dumb or stupid, especially when we're carrying around things like our phones and stuff like that. We don't want to come across as looking foolish, especially when you're in a public setting. But the thing is, that doesn't bother me anymore. And there's a couple of reasons why. Number one would be practice, but two, more so than anything else, is the mere fact that I have a story to tell. I have a mission of teaching people how to use this amazing tool, this amazing medium. And I feel it is my duty and my responsibility to make that happen. Because I don't know if you guys realize that what really happened over the past six years was that I removed myself. I removed myself from these negative thoughts, these negative kind of stories or lies that I was making up to, uh, that ultimately became excuses. And I feel that's what is really holding a lot of people back, including you and a lot of people out there. And it's okay, but it's, we come to a point where you need to realize that it's not about you. Who cares about whether you look foolish or kind of awkward and things like that? Who cares? If you have a message, it is your responsibility to deliver and make sure that you're creating content, video content, where you're able to teach someone because there's someone out there in the world right now who is waiting for you, who's waiting for your message, who's waiting to listen and say, oh my God, this is something that I've been waiting for my whole life, or this is someone that I want to listen to to help me get out of the situation that I'm in right now. Because despite on what you think about whether you're an expert or not, or whether you know something or not, you know something. You have some sort of knowledge that you can help someone right now take and take them out of that hole, provide the solution to the whatever problem that it is that they're experiencing right now. So looking back six years ago, I'm like, man, I wasted a lot of time, right? I wasted a lot of time of being timid, of feeling small, of not feeling that any no one's gonna listen to me and allowing these outside factors, my environment, my external fears to seep in. When now, I'll create video anywhere, I don't care. As long as I have something that I can utilize for audio, hence why I'm using these headphones. But other than that, I'm ready to create video at any moment and I'm ready to share it with you like how I'm sharing it with you right now. All right, so that's my number one tip. My number one tip on how to get over the fear of recording video in public. But guess what? That's not only for just recording videos in public, it's for recording videos, period. Recording, recording video, I cannot talk. Recording videos, period. Once you get yourself into this mindset, once you allow yourself to grow, to expand, and to allow people to learn more about you and your message in using this amazing video or medium to do so, you're gonna take off. You're gonna do better. You're gonna change. You're gonna be awesome. In the comments down below, let me know what you think about what I just shared with you. But most importantly, what is the number one way that you have gotten over your fear of recording video in public? Because we all know it's pretty damn scary, but once you get over it, piece of cake, right? Oh,